Hi there, it's Jason from Checkfront, and today I'm going to show you how to install and configure the Checkfront WordPress booking plugin. So we've got here a vanilla installation of WordPress. We selected a theme from the theme library, and now we're going to go ahead and add the Checkfront booking plugin. So under plugins, you're going to want to look under add new for Checkfront. Okay, there we are there. We'll click on install and then activate. Okay, so you'll see over here it's now listed under your installed plugins. So if we bring up that menu, there's a very simple installation and configuration uh, in that you need to provide your Checkfront host URL. So that's the URL that you were provided with when you first created your account. It's something like mycompany.checkfront.com. We're going to go ahead and use demo.checkfront.com. You don't need to add anything after it, just the host. And you'll see a updated message. So now that we have the plugin activated, we're going to go ahead and create our customer-facing booking page. Now in WordPress, you use something called short codes to embed content or change the behavior of a, of a post. So clicking on the short code generator will bring you back into your Checkfront account to the WordPress configurator. And this allows you to select different layout options or configurations that will change the behavior of the booking page. Um, we're actually just going to go with the default, which is this check front square bracket short code. Um, we're going to go ahead and copy that and then head back to our WordPress. Now we're going to add a new page and we're going to call it book now. And then in the content, you can add whatever you want here to present to your customers on the booking page. We'll go with a simple hello. And where you want the booking portal to be rendered is where you supply the shortcode. So we're going to go ahead with just check front and publish the page. So we can see here now that we've got a new page on our website, which is book now. It's the one we've just created. It's got our introductory content and the Checkfront booking portal rendered inside of it. So as you can see, it fits in really well with the page. Um, it's interactive, so customers can use the calendar to navigate dates and categories. Um, and of course, you can go ahead then and check availability, photos, and make a booking, which is what we want to do. So there's a lot more options within the plugin. Um, you can use the short code generator or you can just go ahead and supply them yourselves. Item ID equals, so if I just want to show a single item in here, I can go ahead and do that. See, it's got the one item. If I want to fast forward to a specific date, I can go to 2013 07.07. .07. Okay, and here we are. That's hopefully enough to get you up and running with Checkfront and WordPress. There are, of course, a lot more options to how you can configure your system both within WordPress and within Checkfront. So drop by www.checkfront.com support for more information.